Ladies and gentlemen, it is your host here. It is Team Ira. And how are you doing on this Wednesday's edition? I am doing very well. Ladies and gentlemen, I have social media accounts, but I will discuss that later on in this video. Now, um, sit back, relax, put your feet out, grab some meat, or grab some drink, or maybe just maybe you want to chill like a villain and hear my thoughts, my opinions, and the subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. This video, it will just strictly be in our home. Alrighty then, now this is just a rumor. Just a rumor, so don't get it bent out of shape if it does not come true for many. Yeah. Now, the rumor is Dewey is considering having Roman Reigns defend both belts on two different nights, night one and night two. That means a double duty. I'm okay with that. But who should dethrone him on night one? Who should dethrone him on night two? I hopefully it's not The Rock for night two because I want a non-title match. In my opinion, my opinion only, he don't need to defend both belts on both nights. Just defend it. On one night, that's fine. And then the second night, or maybe the first night, faces Cousin The Rock. Everyone wants to see that matchup if it does happen. If it does not happen, I'm assuming WWE needs to come up with a plan B. Okay? So, I don't know who, who will dethrone them. It could be Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn. I know Kevin Owens is going to have a match with Roman. At Rumble, so that's not gonna happen. Um, it could be anyone, so but I think it's gonna be I don't know who it could be, it could be anyone. So, and it better not be a, a huge tour. So, what the hell? I thought Roman's gonna drop the belt, and we decided to let Roman keep the title. So, hopefully, that's not the last option, that'd be very dumb. It's time for him to drop it. Okay, I'm sorry. He's way overdue of dropping the belt. You know how I feel about that. I know it's a business decision. So, it better not be The Rock. You know, look what happened back in the day. So, I'm not even going any further or not. So, it better be like, maybe Corey Rhodes, if he's back in time for the Rumble and face the champion of his choosing, and of course, it'd be Roman because Roman has that belt way too long. Or it could be maybe for a wild card, Bray Wyatt, but they're not using Bray Wyatt. This new character, I mean, that they're not using him very good, so I'm kind of disappointed. So maybe things will get better d down the road, you know, it'll just take a long process for the Bray Wyatt get back in the title picture, but anyway. So, I don't know. It could be anyone. I don't think it would be Sami Zayn because I don't picture him as a championship caliber kind of guy. I just can't imagine him. I don't take him seriously. Maybe his gimmick will change. Maybe. I don't know. So, I think the only guy I could think of is the throwing the champion of all champions in this modern era for WWE is Kevin Owens. Maybe Kevin Owens will get another rematch. Or it could be someone else. Either would work. Maybe someone from NXT. I flipping doubt it. So it could be anyone, you know? Anyone. Just if you want to book Rock versus Roman, make it a non title match. Let Roman lose both of the belts on night one. It makes sense. Okay? Don't let him defend one belt on night one and then defend the other belt on night two. That's I think that's kinda of dumb, but this is the hopefully the rumors are not true. So what's your thoughts on this? Should he defend both belts on one night? Or do you prefer him defending the belts on one night and then the second night? You know, he's going to lose both of them. And I guess we are definitely going to have a draft after WrestleMania. So that means they're going to split the belts and all the other stuff. So all the other interesting discussions. So... Information right here. I'm going to try my best. Dewey is already has WrestleMania plans in place for Roman Reigns and the Bloodline. 
but things could always change now to then, you know? According to a report from WrestlingNews.com or Inc., Roman will continue his reign few with Kevin Owens with a match in the 2023 Royal Rumble. We all know that. That's a rematch from two years ago at the 2020 uh, Royal Rumble. You know, that was a crappy finish. So, um, I love to see Kevin Owens get his revenge and become champion. We all happen under Triple H era. Time will tell. Okay. Now, once Roman Reigns lose both the belts, will the bloodline still be intact? That's the question. We'll find out. Are you tired of Roman Reigns still the champion? The top of the food chain? I am. Okay. At first, I was okay with it. But months, weeks pass by, and it's time for a new champion. I'm sorry. We need a champion who's always on Raw, always on SmackDown, and wants to defend his belts. He's not the guy anymore. I'm sorry. He's not the guy. He wants to be a family man. That's fine with Danny. Just drop the flipping belts, and we we'll go on with our lives. That's just how I feel. If you love my opinion, that's fine with Danny, you know? I have no issues with him. But as a champion, that's a different story, okay? I know you guys will never agree with me. That's fine. Now, follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. If you want to be part of the Royal Rush, that's fine and Danny. We could discuss about this, the NFL, college, movies, and beyond. Have a good one, and I'll see you guys tonight sometime. Later, Gators.